In Post Lafayette, Mauritius, um, our business has been closed. Um, government here has shut down all businesses, rightfully, to stop the spread of the COVID-19 virus. Um, for us, business goes on. I'm going to show you how, in ancient times, a bangle was produced by melting uh, silver and, or gold and poured into an ingot. And what I'm doing here is chipping away to create an ingot mold. And I'll show you the results later on, but I'm creating a groove into this basalt rock. Basalt is the main rock we have in Mauritius. It's an igneous rock. I've picked this piece up off the beach and I'm gonna produce bangles the old way. So I'll come back to you just now with, with some more results. So we're much further down the road here and um, I carved out a lovely groove. It's got a lot of character in it. And this is now, this is gonna now form our, our ingot mold. So here we have a beanie, beanie boy. Uh, we have oxygen and an LPG gas with a standard jewelry brazing torch. I bought this home the other day thinking that things might go into lockdown and they have. So this is, allows us to carry on producing jewelry. Over here, I've put together a little hearth, just with an additional couple rocks and the uh, little aluminium hood from our barbecue. We've got borax here. Borax, actually, when you smelt silver or, or gold, just, just purifies the, the metal. Um, pinch of that. And this is a crucible for smelting the metal. Over here is the ingot mold, uh, and that is engine oil just poured into that it helps release the the, the, the silver bar that we're going to form over here here we have our silver with copper so that's sterling silver inside a crucible we're just going to bring that to it to a nice heat now annealing the metal it's making it softer so I can work it and forge out a strip of metal to to form into a bangle shape um, then I'll hammer it after hammering it becomes work hardened again it needs to be annealed worked annealed worked so this is what you see going on here getting it to a nice even what we call a cherry red color So we're starting to get a beautiful hammered shape here, stretching that out to form round into a bangle. So what we've got here, we're starting to get a classic, simple bangle shape, just like it would have been made thousands of years ago, hand forged. Say good morning. Good morning, everybody. So what we're doing here is, um, I don't have any polishing equipment, um, so I'm going to yeah. bring out the silver color by filing yeah. it. 
I've still got a bit of work to do here. So we'll be filing this piece, um, bringing out the silver color on it. I've got my little... And that is an amazing weed that Azan has found. I'm calling these bangles forged by the ocean. Every piece that we sell will be stamped with a serial number. A proceed of every piece sold will go to the Mauritian Wildlife Foundation. This is an organization that we've supported for the last 10 years. Our commitment remains firm to carry on donating to this incredible organization. Our commitment to our business continues that we remain open and proud of our craft. That is our 925 sterling silver stamp 001. This is a serial number for this limited edition forged by the ocean Mauritian wildlife collection. And that is our SW10 stamp, meaning we are registered with the Mauritian assay office.